is in this video we are going to see how to form a 4 bit binary adder uh, using half adder and uh, full uh, half full adder now here to do that we have to form the circuit so first you can press this plus symbol and then you get you can give a name for this as half adder Now, once you have given, you just make sure double click so that you will be in that screen. Now, you have to uh, draw the diagram for, uh, circuit for the half adder. So, you know, half adder consists of one AND gate and one XOR gate. So, we'll do the AND gate and uh, XOR gate. Just let us change the face to stop. Now you have to connect it to A and B respectively. And this will change it to facing so. Yes. Now we give this connection. Yes, let us consider this as to be A and this to be B. Now, output. Yes, now you can check the, uh, the two cables. In both are zero, it is zero. Now this is uh, carry actually. This is carry and this is sum. Okay, now you can check when both are zero, it is zero. Any one of this is one you have as an XR, you'll get one. When both are one, you get zero and carry is one. Okay, zero, one, you get so now the half adder circuit is working correct. Now we are going to use a full adder. We are going to create a full adder. So a full adder consists of two half adder and one R gate. So since already I have built the half adder, I'm going to directly use it here. So that is the actual advantage of a circuit combinatorial circuit is called so already we have created see if you see that already we have created this so no need to draw all these things again so in full adder you directly copy and paste this half adder which is a block now it shows like a block diagram now this is for carry input and these two are the a and b input since uh, they are very close I have, I'm drawing like this. This is A and this is B. And then this is carrying because a full adder will add three inputs. Three bit of information. So now the output of this that is uh, here you will have the uh, output as uh, what we have we have in the half adder sum and carry. So the sum is going giving us input and this is the third bit and scary here it is the sum now we have to use an or gate to add the, the the output of this so first let me convert it into sum
so now this will have the carry and this is working by sum Okay, now, you know, when you are adding, when it is one, then you have sum. Then when you are adding two, then you have sum, one, one. When you have three inputs, one, 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 then you have one, both sum and carry to be one, one. So we have checked out, but now we are going to, with this full adder and half adder, we are going to form the uh, four bit binary adder. So for that again, I am creating another uh, circuit with name 4 bit adder. So now it is there. So full half adder is there. Full adder circuit is also there. Now in 4 bit adder, you are going to use one half adder for adding the first two bits. Then the carry will be given to the next, next full adder. So there will be one half adder and three full adder. As we are going to do, Okay, it has been turned like this. So here is how the okay. I don't want like this, so just try remove this. As I want all uh, to be like this, that's why I'm changing this. To so. Yes, now when I see this, see here, it has been changed. The point has come here. So, so depending upon how we give the directions, here the block diagram change.